Staffing shortages continue to cause issues for hospitals across the country. Hospitals in rural communities are struggling to find their patients' care. News 4 Tucson's Nicole Costantino joins us live from Tucson Medical Center now with the impact we're seeing in southern Arizona. Good morning, Nicole. Robbie Destiny, good morning. While our more urban hospitals like here at TMC might have beds available for transfer patients, they don't have the staff to tend to them. Rural hospitals say that that's having their patients stay put and wait for a higher level of care. The difference with our current pandemic situation is it affects everything. Gary Karchner is the emergency department manager and trauma director at Benson Hospital. It's a critical access hospital or CAH, which means it has no more than 25 inpatient beds, can't exceed a 96 hour length of stay, and must be more than a 35 mile drive from any other hospital or CAH. As a critical access hospital, we are limited on our resources and what we can do to take care of patients. One of the key factors of a CAH is transferring patients to larger hospitals who need a higher level of care. We normally, especially this time of year, would never have a, a struggle in transferring a patient to another hospital in Tucson. In the last three months, Karchner says he's had multiple patients stay anywhere from 15 to 72 hours waiting for a transfer. We're not helping that patient and there's a real chance for deterioration in their condition by having them sit here. Critical access hospitals don't have intensive care units or the more critical care services normally found at larger hospitals, something Benson Hospital CEO Julia Strange says they rely on their urban partners for. We appreciate the struggles that the urban hospitals are facing and I, um, I would prefer that the hospitals accept our patients when they have the appropriate staffing um, rather than trying to stretch to accept them. We have excellent doctors and amazing staff, but at the same time, there's only so much that we can do for these patients, you know, while they sit in our emergency department. Benson Hospital staff say they do have highly skilled nurses and nurse technicians to take care of these patients while they wait to be transferred. Hospital staff also tells me that they haven't had to transfer anybody out of Arizona yet, and they've been able to work with their urban hospital partners. When asked what they need most, more staff. Live outside Tucson Medical Center, Nicole Constantino, News 4 Tucson.